Thank you guys so much for 200 subscribers. I will be doing a couple giveaways soon. Um, so be sure to subscribe if you want to be a part of them and join my Discord. But anyways, enjoy the video. Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy here, Glowstick, back with another video. And back with another JavaScript video because I have to catch up on these. Um, I'm doing something that you guys have asked for such a long time. Which is a snipe command in Discord.js. I will get to Discord.py, do not worry. Discord.py, a video should be coming out soon. I know you guys really want them, but I have to do both. But yeah, this is how you do a snipe command in Discord.js. So let's get straight into it. What we want to start off by doing is we want to create a new variable up top here called snipes. And that's going to be go to new Discord.collection. Like so. And then when we have that, we can scroll down a bit. So here and we can create another uh event so client on and it's going to be message delete so open that up so and then pass in message arrow function open that up like so then we want to do snipes dot get message dot channel dot id once we have that we can uh put in a comma and then do message also and then that's gonna be it for that scroll down and we can start on the command part so do else if command equals 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 snipe and then open that up now we won't be able to actually use the command handler for this because uh we're using this and we would have to import it and i've tried that it gives a lot of errors <coughs> so we're just gonna be doing it here and so yeah uh we can do let's snipes wait no just snipe let's snipe equals snipes dot get uh, and then message dot channel dot id so it grabs a message id oh uh, from the channel and then we can do if snipe equals 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 undefined oh, i spelled that wrong so i'm gonna grab it from here and actually make sure you end this like that make sure no quotes around it just undefined and then we can open that up saying message.channel.send no recently did messages and do else snipe embed let's call it that i guess and that can be equal to new discord message discord sorry oh, capital d message embed so now that we have that we can that should be a function and then we can actually make them but so do set title to last deleted message i'll make this capital also and then we can do dot set option to make sure you use the total keys and then do deleted message and now we can use dash um the things i forgot what they are called but do snipe and boom now we can just send this saying um actually let's just do set timestamp and then we can send this saying message dot channel dot send snipe embed So now let's go ahead and run this. Doing node space dot and I'll be back when it runs. Okay, it has ran. And we can just do um, ping just to make sure it is running. And there we go. And then if we do, if we just do um, snipe, it says no deleted message. And then, oh, oh, uh, I forgot about this. I had to delete the AI chatbot from yesterday's video so it doesn't interfere with ours. But now if we do msnipe, 
no recently deleted messages because we didn't delete anything. But let's say, I don't know. Oh, no, no, we deleted that. No one can see it. And then, no, no, I spelled that wrong. I cannot spell. And voila. Okay, so I fixed it. There really wasn't a bug. I said to restart it, I guess. But now if we do lol and then, like, delete it. Then do M snipe. Said M snipe. It says last deleted message, right? So if we do like this, the M snipe, it results in so like drive to glow stick. Oh, I found that, so now you have to do it. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, there you go. That's gonna be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed. Until next time, let's go. See ya.